Operator rating is shown to the left of the time column right here. Uh, by default, it's going to, anytime you restart a study after a, a pause, it's going to go to 100. Uh, so when I hit the start button to, uh, to start here, uh, here's the time increment, you can see the 100 here. And that 100 is carried forward to each subsequent observation. So here I have a repetitive study, and I'm just moving through it here. And uh, let's say they get work order. Now let's say the next time it goes to walk to storage, uh, we want to change the rating. So you're basically going to tap your stylus on the 100 here, and it's going to bring up the different values you have. Let's say it's perf underperforming a little bit. We can put 80 in there, and that 80 value will be carried forward to the subsequent observations until we decide to pick it up again. So let's say next time he goes to walk, he picks up his pace a little bit. We can touch it again. The default will show, of course. You can scroll down and you can maybe make it 95 and continue there. So that's how you can move around making the different rating entries. It'll be carried forward again. You can go back to any previous observation. So let's say I wanted to change this one for whatever reason to another value. I can just touch it and I can make it maybe 70 here. So you can see you can basically move around uh, changing the rating as and when you require.